Hello, you lovely people. Google Mini. We're gonna modify this. We're gonna modify it and we're gonna chuck a big old speaker at it. This is a paradigm. See how we get on. Hey Google, do you love me? I love helping you, even more than I love searching. Oh, that's so sweet. Hey Google. Love you. <laughs> you love me? This is a great day. <laughs> Yeah, so I've got a few friends that have got things like the Amazon Alexa, um, and I've always been more of a Google fan for some reason or another. So I thought, well, you know, I'd have a look on eBay and see what I could find. And yeah, 25 quid got me this Google Home Mini. Um, and it is quite mini. It's quite tiny, as you can see there. It's quite easy to take apart. Torx screwdriver is is what you need. Uh, they, they don't use standard screws in here. No, it's Google stuff. And the speaker isn't exactly massive either. Um, but it does sort of work, but it doesn't have much in the way. A bass response, and it doesn't really give much drive output. It's more of a talking speaker than it is a music speaker. Anyway, cutting a long story short, or cutting the cable off in this case, what I really wanted was something in the kitchen that I could shout at to play Radio 2 or something nice and gentle like that, rather than mch, 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 Radio 1. Um, and, uh, you know, the, the home mini was sort of made perfect sense, really. But it didn't have uh, enough of a rounded sound to it. It didn't have enough bass to it. It didn't. Um, it didn't have a nice top end to it. So I just thought, right, okay, uh, it needs modifying. I thought, yeah, you know what? I wonder if I can find a way to get this device to drive the Paradigm speaker. And sure enough. A little bit of jiggery pokery and bodging around. Boom, here we've got it. A paradigm speaker, a nice hi fi speaker, you know, two drivers in there, one tweeter, one bass. And yeah, chuck the old Google at it. Why not? Let's see what it sounds like. <laughs> Holy wow, that sounds nice. Yes, yes it does. It sounds really nice. It's got a lovely round sort of throaty gentle sound to it. And um, what I didn't realise at this point in time was the fact that the tweeter in that Paradigm speaker had blown. I think I'd sort of, you know, driven it a little bit too hard in its previous, uh, in its previous work when I lived out in the States. And um, yeah, uh, yeah, didn't didn't work out very well for it. it blew blew the, blew the tweeter up in this thing. Um, so a little bit later on, you'll 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 see me getting back into this uh, paradigm. And actually, the speaker that came out of the Google um, device worked beautifully as a replacement tweeter. So uh, anyway, yeah, uh, more of that later. And then there's the Google Maxi. <laughs> hey Google, what do you think? I always think, what would the engineers say? Exactly. Thank you very much. <laughs> wicked, wicked. This is this is absolutely awesome. I mean, it's loud. It's it's got bass now. So the speaker in it. It's tiny. It's it's an inch across. Um, yeah. Okay. I could have spent some money, but you know, I'm frugal. <laughs> I made this. This is awesome. <laughs> And after all that, I realised that it still wasn't quite where it needed to be. So, the bad boy got popped open. And yes, the little Google speaker. <laughs> the little Google speaker fits perfectly in place of the tweeter that's open circuit. Yes, properly open circuit. So. Uh, yeah, there we go. So now we've got a little bit more Google inside the Google Monster. Hey Google. Love you. <laughs> you love me? This is a great day. <laughs> <laughs> hey Google, can you make the noisy of donkey? I say, hey Google, <laughs> I say donkey, not frog. 
This is a donkey. Hey Google, can you make the noise of a ghost? This is a ghost. Oh, sounds like an air raid siren. <laughs> Hey Google, can you make the noise of vintage computer games? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey Google, who's Cousin It? According to Wikipedia, Cousin ITT is a fictional character in the Adams Family television and film series. Hey Google, my English is really that bad. Sorry, I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Hey Google, I hate you. Sorry to hear that. What needs to be improved? Hey Google, say that again, please. I said, in Chinese China, you would say, Qianren. But you are not right. Google, hey Google, hey Google, <laughs> hey Google, you are not right. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm always trying to improve. <laughs> How did you say thank you in Chinese? In Chinese China, you would say Xie Hmm, good. Hey Google, what should we eat for lunch? I found a few places within 2.4 miles. <sighs> cool, anyway, here it is. Our new, really improved Hey Google box. <laughs> bring down the doves from above <laughs> oh this is awesome I, I i'm gonna play with my google all night long as always thanks ever so much for watching dubious engineering um uh, subscribe give us a good old thumbs up and um yeah maybe you might want to upgrade your google to hey google do you love me you make my algorithms feel fuzzy yeah <laughs> She's loud. <laughs>